What's up, mechanics? Happy Tuesday, and welcome back to Vim Tools headquarters. We're going to go right into questions, and we have some updates and uh, some things that we want to tell you about afterwards before we get into this stuff. So, I'm going to read these questions to you. Why don't you answer them? All right, cool beans. Uh, the first one is: Are you going to make three quarter sockets for the HDR 34K? So. We actually do already make three-quarter socket. They're just not Vim branded. We private label a ton of the heavy-duty stuff, like I've said before on this page. But uh, three-quarter sockets, is there? Do you think there's a big demand for Vim tools three-quarter sockets? Do you think that people would go to us for all the heavy-duty needs? If they would, maybe that's something we look into. Drop a uh, drop a comment. Let us know what you think about us coming out with some super heavy-duty, some three-quarter sockets, maybe even bigger than that. Who knows? We can get them. We can make them, but it's. Uh, I don't know if the demand's there for Vim branded super heavy duty sockets. Maybe later on. Exactly. Maybe as we grow, but right now it's not exactly the our bread and butter per se. So We're inventory is, you know, there's limited space that you could put stuff in and three quarter sockets are not what we're really trying to fill it with. But if you think they sell great, if you think you'd buy a pair of Vim three quarter or a set of Vim three quarter sockets, let us know. Sticking with our niche for now. Yeah, that, that'd be the move. Okay. Uh, someone commented on the S2BK100 video and said this is literally what an impact gun does so there's a difference between this and this those are two different types of forces so the point of the s2bk100 is to vibrate back and forth so that while you're turning it you're not actually going to either completely destroy the the, the around the fastener or shear the head off or, or exactly or just shear it completely off where you're getting a tap and die anyways especially when something's very rusty exactly the point is to try to avoid those issues that's why this force is a lot easier to allow you to manually break loose instead of an impact gun doing it rounding the head off or just snapping it off clean and then you're turning into a long day yeah so you're punching while using hand force to turn and it, there is a difference and i i am really surprised how many people did not just weren't fathoming it I know. And sometimes, like, you'll, <laughs> as someone who's, or as we've newly started doing this to where we're answering comments and doing all this, so I've never had experience with it, but as I notice, you'll answer and quote-unquote argue with, like, four or five people about the same thing, and then it's just, like, people go comment it and don't read the ten different arguments that already happened about the same exact, like, situation. Yeah. Because they'll leave 20 comments under it saying the same thing, you're like, oh, this isn't worth it anymore. Or, like, the RFW100, <laughs> we posted a... Uh, video of that on tiktok and instagram and the everyone was saying oh you loosened that o2 sensor before uh, but the right before that it was guys this is just demonstration purposes only that's true let me yeah. tell you people are fucking skeptical <laughs> that's it's wild it they, they want you to be wrong so bad <laughs> <laughs> it's ignorant it's crazy all right okay let's see if we have a couple more yeah ask more questions if you want to hear more answers. More questions you got, more answers we can give. Okay, so two things. One, the quarter inch set that comes in, these fo in this foam, SMS 400, we are going to soon be releasing subsets of each line and that you see here. And by soon we mean here. what, like, like two weeks? Yeah, like a week, two weeks we'll have, you know, final samples of how we're going to have them displayed. So you guys can see them. Yeah, It'll be the same soon. product, but so displayed differently. So we'll do a subset of the deep SAE, the deep metric, the shallow SAE, and the shallow metric. Uh, in the quarter inch and in the three eighth set, yes, as well, and those are all going to come on magros. Yes, and They're next week we'll actually show you what the final product looks like, and Melissa will leave the the part numbers here so that you can see exactly what to order. If you're someone who likes the socket sets but doesn't need something this crazy, you just want all the deep sockets because you like how our sockets are and how they work. Well, some people don't use standard at all. So I'm saying some people don't use them, so you just buy the you just buy these two and your ratchet if that's all you need, as opposed to actually going and buying the full set. So you'll have that option. We'll have all those different variations available for your convenience. Bam. You don't have to pay for the full set. You can just get what you need. Personally, I like having it in the foam and having everything together. But again, like I've said multiple times, I'm no mechanic. I'm just aesthetic. Well, dude, people have tons of sockets already. So when you're like, hey, check out this full set, they're like, well, a lot of those I don't need. But I would love the shallow sockets. That is amazing. The metric. Year show. They're like, well, brother, we sell you know, eight different socket sets. So I'd much rather just be able to get these. We listened, here we are. But these are still available. They are. And you can get them if you want them. And this isn't really new, is it? I mean, it's updated. It's not new, but updated. we had people asking us, hey, I've actually had like four or five different people ask me in the last actually, few months, do you guys have a universal joint triple square set? It's something that's not that common, so it's hard to find, but we got them. Yeah, we posted that on Instagram a couple weeks ago. Boys. Talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Yeah, so for European cars, Universal, <clears throat> XZN, or triple square, it's a lot of people call them. All quarter drive, no, these are not spring-loaded. Okay, I know that's a, that's a big thing for us, but these are not spring-loaded. Yeah, and these go 4 through 12. There you go. Now, another thing about triple squares. I know I showed you these probably last week or the week before that. The XCN 400, which is the old version that we just got back in, right? So these guys, as I've shown, are going to be phased out, and they're going to move to the XCN S400A, which is the 13-piece set instead of this, I believe, 9-piece nine, nine set. So it's going to be a more complete set full. That means that these guys, what we have left is most likely going to end up being promoed through your local tool truck, wherever it is that they may buy, because I'll be offering that promo to anybody and everybody who buys the product. So that will be something that you'll see on your local tool truck. Ask them to you know, inquire with whoever they buy from about the XEN 400 promos, because that's something that I'm going to be coming out with. And the push from you guys helps my push a lot easier on my end. So XEN 400, if there's something you like, and you want to get a good deal on it, ask your local tool truck to, you know, ask their rep what the heck's going on. I guarantee you that'll get the ball rolling. We'll get these out for them. One more. This is, as always, S2. These drivers are impact rated. The sockets are impact quality, but they're satin finished. You can use these on an impact, and if something happens to them, we're not going to deny your warranty. No, you'll get warranted with the new version, which is actually kind of nice. But, hey, that's on you. <laughs> That's an incentive right there. That's it, right? <laughs> you just buy them and break all of That's them. That's an incentive. Get a new buy one. the old set for cheaper, break them all, send them in, right. get the new set for free. It's called... Okay, asterisk. <laughs> Finesse. <laughs> all right. Um, last thing I want to talk about are these guys. Our 15-piece M35 Cobalt quarter-inch power shanks, multi-step drill bits, right? This set is 15 pieces, and it comes conveniently on this magnetic MR bit base here so that you can actually stick it to your toolbox or any other metal surface. It sticks with no problem. It also sticks upside down. There's really not any other drill bit holders that you can do this with on the market. As a matter of fact, I guarantee you there's probably not one. And they come out real easily still. You can organize them however you'd like. Again, they're made out of M35 Cobalt. It's a nice little drill bit kit. I can put a close Yeah, I'm having trouble focusing the actual tips of them so Melissa might add a close-up but that did a pretty good job right there and all the part numbers are conveniently marked right there so you can easily see what part number it is if you need to order another one or anything like that when you're looking at drill bits pay attention to the material because you know we, we posted a picture of our hyper steps the the 49 it's 49 29 piece set and uh which retails for what, three hundred dollars? It retails for around three hundred bucks, and people yeah. were complaining, saying Matco's is forty dollars cheaper. Exactly, Matco's this, Matco that, but they weren't realizing that the M thirty five Cobalt one, is, well, that ours was M thirty five Cobalt, and Matco's was just high speed steel. Obviously, Matco has an M thirty five Cobalt set, but that will retail price is around five fifty. So, I mean, not that it's you know, there's different sets, but the material on your drill bits makes a huge difference in cost. Uh, and high speed steel is a lot less expensive. It's also a much weaker material. But that's why you're getting that cost. That's why you're paying for that at that yeah. point. Yeah, our drill bits are M35 Cobalt. And nothing else on the market comes with our magnetic rail on a bit base, just like this. Mm. And for those of you who are wondering, do you have a bigger set for the 29 piece? Yes, the fuck we do. Right there with all the sizes marked, the part number on that one is MDBH42 for 42 slots. MDBH. Oh, the holder. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it also comes with 13 extra slots on top of your 29 piece, which is why it's actually a 42 slot. So you can have 13 extra spots for your quarter inch shanks or regular drill bits at that point, whatever you'd like. But same concept, just double wide of this. Super heavy duty, holds up no problem. Nothing else can do that. Still comes out relatively easy. No now, trouble. If you have anywhere else that you hold drill bits, you can just take those out and this is a uh, magnetic bit holder. So you can throw quarter inch regular bits in here because there's a bunch more sp spots available. Exactly. You for could throw so things in. I mean, it's, I could bundle it up in one little, you know, tiny corner of the of the, the braille, but it kind of looked weird. So I kept it like that. <laughs> I mean, but you can yeah. do whatever the hell you want. So. Yeah. Okay. That's where we're at. I think that's it for today, right? Yeah. Well, we got the mystery box giveaway that yes. this is the last week, right? Yeah. Of this month. So this is the last week for you to enter on our Instagram. Go like you sure you don't have the, the, next week? the first pinned post 
on our Instagram, which is the SMS 600. Uh, like, tag a friend. Make sure you're following us. Next week. Okay, you got a week and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Next make, week, you have another Tuesday. Though. Make sure you're following us and you are entered to win one of our mystery boxes. And we stack those mystery boxes. We might put a little so, more extra since it's Memorial Day week that day. Memorial there Day extras. So make sure you we'll get on that. We'll throw some in there, and then we'll announce it like always the first week of the month. Now, I know Michael last time said it's the last week of the month, and someone lost their shit on him, but we'll, we'll do it the first week <laughs> of the month. Cut me some slack. <laughs> like uh, I said, people are skeptic. They want you to be wrong here. Also, we're going to be maybe doing some different things with Tool Tuesday, maybe going downstairs and doing some demonstrations of the product or testing products, trying to do a little more to make this show a little more interesting. If you have any suggestions on what you might want to see on this channel, let us know. Because we're we'll changing take it, it up. We're we'll changing it up to make it more fun. Also, I'm getting bored, so I want to have more fun. I don't want to stand by this table anymore. <laughs> Do you want to mention what we have in mind? Yeah, go ahead. So uh, our ratchets, our heavy-duty ratchets, HDR 410, 614, 410, 614, 410, 818. 818. Heavy-duty ratchets. These bad boys, the quarter, three-eighths, and half. Uh, a lot of people were saying that they're interested in them, but they don't see any videos of people testing these online. So we're going to test them. And we're going to change that. And uh, change it. That fact. We're going to test them ourselves, and then we can send them out to people so they can test them as well. Oh, the yeah. testing channels. <laughs> I thought you were talking about something else. No, we're going to send them to people so they can test them. Because you're right. Every time I go to see different ratchet reviews, it's never I, mean, I know we're ratchet. not known for our ratchets, but... I've never seen one of our ratchets on one of those. So I want to try to get ours involved in that race because I guarantee you we'll be higher up in that chain than most people think. They're good ratchets. They're good. Yeah. So, yeah, let us know. And stay tuned, and we'll see you next week. All righty, guys. Peace out. Peace.